New at 10, Texas teachers say they've got continued concerns about how in-person learning will work. They worry about their health and the health of their students. Now, at this point, some teachers have been in school for a few weeks now. Others only a couple of days. Our Anastasia Bolton checks in to see how things are going. Virtual learning is, is not awesome. Change is hard. I'm glad that we have have the option. Pandemic induced necessary change is harder. It is so hard for me not to hug and love on children. Hardest thing I've ever done in my life, teaching virtually and face to face at the same exact time. I was so sure I'm not going back. I'm not, you know, and then I saw one of them. I'm like, ah! Babies. And I haven't had a chance to really forge any bonds with my, my my kids yet. They say their kids' needs haven't changed, but it is more difficult to give them everything a teacher wants. I think I've cried on the way home every day. This year, feel like your hands aren't big enough to catch everything. And you know that your kids in the room aren't getting all of you. You know your kids online aren't getting all of you. Change doesn't work for everyone. A lot of our at-home learners, they are not doing their part. It can't. I had one of my kids today that was, um, he disappeared, his camera was on. He was gone for about five minutes and I was like, and he sat back down in his chair. I was like, hey, where'd you go? He's like, oh, my mom wanted me to do something. And then I rode my scooter around for a little bit, but I'm back. And I was like, okay. Teachers we talk to are adapting. And we're doing the best we can. Well, I'm just trying to be somebody my kids can lean on and we can kind of get through this together. But change can also be good. It can and does surprise. Teachers are humanized. We have communities that are finally like, oh, you have right. a pulse and a family right. and a life. You would like to not die. We were like, yeah, yeah. We also wanted to not die when there were like, you know, mass shooters. But you just like, hey, just Tell walk over here and go in the corner and you'll be fine. Being seen and heard is nice. Teachers hope that doesn't change. My only final request is that the governor continue to maintain um, a requirement for masks. That is when I may very well consider just leaving the career. If I have to walk into a building where people can pretend that they live in like a personal freedom bubble where their germs don't get out, um, <laughs> I hope the governor will do right by Texas teachers is my final thought. I'm Anastasia Bolton.